Hey, hey, welcome back to our Hungry Adventures. Hungry Adventures in Thailand and yeah guys, I have decided to rent this condo and stay in Krabi for a while until the situation will get better. A bit later I'm gonna make a tour of my condo because I know how much you love seeing rooms and apartments that I choose to stay on my trips. The video is coming soon, however today I've got another specific topic to discuss. In today's video, I want to tell you about the music that I use in my videos. Because as I see from your comments, all of you are really enjoying it. These are your words. The music is sublime, very soothing, well-chosen music. You put nice and relaxing music on the video. Great music choice. I love your drone video with some magical music. Especially enjoy all the beautiful music on this video. Drone work and music is breathtaking. Beautiful scenery and perfect music to match it. And this is only a small fraction of comments related to music, and I get them on every new episode I create on this channel. And that's why I have decided to reveal this secret, which is not secret at all, about how and where I get this music from, since it's not only my music library for the videos, but also one of my playlists that I listen on a regular basis. And from the foundation of this channel, I've been using one and only service that satisfies all my needs in all possible ways. It's called Artlist. And today's video is sponsored by Artlist, which provides truly really unique catalog of high-quality music from independent artists around the world. And I personally believe that music is not less important than visuals and audio, or maybe even more important, because with adding different background music, you can completely change the atmosphere and tone of the video, make it more dramatic and intense, more scary or more funny and relaxed. Music helps the audience to feel more engaged, to feel the presence in the scene itself. And as a creator, you can cover sound issues issues with adding background music, fix emptiness and silence, or simply transform boring parts of the footage into something more entertaining and exciting, help the audience to feel your story much better, and improve the connection between different parts of your story. When I have started creating videos, I have quickly found out that you can't add any song that you like in a video, upload it on YouTube and get monetized. We are living in a world of copyright and licenses, and even if you are making a vlog while walking on the street, and there will be a speaker somewhere behind you playing some song, and this song belongs to some artist, you will get copyright claim quite instantly, and won't be able to monetize that video on YouTube. And that's why I have started to look for music service that can solve this issue, a music library that would allow me to use songs of other artists, and still being able to monetize it without getting copyright claims. And I have found Artlist, and keep using it since then. Because Artlist simply provides you with one unlimited license covering all tracks they've got in the catalog, which at the present moment consists over 12,000 songs. Songs and tracks from independent artists around the world, with and without vocals, sound effects, even Christmas collections, and new music added every day, and I really mean it. They add new music every day, and you know how hard it is to find something you haven't heard before. Something you haven't heard million times on the radio. It's really amazing. Artlist License allows you to use this music in vlogs, films, and video projects on any platform worldwide for both personal and commercial use. In other words, you can use this music on any project you want and upload it everywhere you want. And besides that, all of the tracks in the library are being cleared by YouTube even before being published in the catalog. So you don't have to worry about copyright issues when you are uploading your videos on a channel. And I've been using Artlist since the beginning of 2019, a long time before Hungry Adventure series, and even before my trips to Nepal, India and Myanmar. So I think let's simply jump to the website, I'll show you how does it look, how does it work, and how do I usually look for a proper soundtrack for my videos. Or simply enjoying great music depending on my mood. As you see guys, the website structure is quite clear and easy to use. You can choose the mood which suits you the best. Powerful, exciting, happy, carefree, love, playful and so on. Peaceful for example. What's here? What a lovely track. And these filters are really helpful, guys, especially in my case. Because as you know, I like to combine funny and positive scenes, such as presenting hotels, enjoying in restaurants, talking to people, with epic sunsets and drone flights, waterfalls and beaches, and even exploration of dark caves with tense background music.
And alternatively, you can use video theme filter. Time-lapse, food, education, documentary, weddings, blog and commercial, road trip, travel and so on. But also there are genre and instrument filters, so that you literally can select musical instruments you like to hear in the track. For example, let it be electric guitar, keys and, and piano. And what genre the artist should be playing? Let's make it cinematic. And now you can simply pick the songs that fit your idea in the footage and download them. It's quite amazing. Let's try. Sounds like boiling kettle. Let's try something more peaceful. Yeah, it's gotta be a great opening scene. Oh yeah, I love this one. You can choose the duration of the song. You can choose tempo, low, medium and high. You can sort the library by the most popular tracks, top downloads. You can select the newest downloads. Or you can sort it by stuff peaks. And it's not the end yet, you can narrow your search even more. You can select instruments only or music with vocal. You can select female and male vocal and few more options. All these filters are really helpful when you're looking for something specific for your project. You can even see the audio waveform, which helps you to understand the structure of the song, even before you have listened to it. And when I'm not sure what would fit my video the most, I simply choose the mood and start exploring collection. Let it be peaceful. Meanwhile, I also play the footage in my Adobe Premiere, as it helps to understand does the song match with the video well or not. Yeah, let's choose this track, it sounds pretty nice, so now I'm gonna hit the download button. And it's done! I can use this track now. It also will be delivered to my email, so I can get back to it anytime later as well. Alternatively, I can open my own music library, where I can download it in MP3, in WAV or just see my license. So now I'm gonna drag the track into my project and find the part that fits the video the most. o'clock in the morning well technically it's 5 30 but i've woken up at 5 and it's time to go to the mountain to enjoy the sunrise and i think it's going to be really stunning because the sky looks incredible here ah, but i'd love to sleep a little bit longer you can see it on my face right <laughs> ah. and let's see how does it sound without music right now Oh, 
It's 5 o'clock in the morning. Well, technically it's 5.30, but I've woken up at 5. And it's time to go to the mountain to enjoy the sunrise. So yeah, without background music, the pace of the video feels much different, as there is some kind of emptiness, some void, with completely different tone. And even though you can hear the raw sounds of this scene, it doesn't feel that engaging anymore. The emotions are just not the same. So well-chosen soundtracks and your music choice really matter. Okay, guys, and the last one, really the last one. The music you download is yours forever. Any song you download is yours to use without time limits, even if your subscription expires. All music you have downloaded is still yours, even if you don't resubscribe. Isn't it fantastic? But it's true! So I want to thank Artlist once again for sponsoring this video. Guys, definitely check them out, the link is down below. Their music is available at $199 a year, and it doesn't matter how many songs you want to download, what platform you are on, or what kind of project you film, you are getting an unlimited license for unlimited use. So if you make YouTube videos or commercial projects, weddings, documentaries, company presentations, Artlist is a really great choice in my opinion. On top of that, they also have got a sound effects library now, so it's definitely an excellent choice for all filmmakers, videographers and vloggers, of course. Besides music subscription, Artlist has also a stock footage licensing platform called Artgrid, which is another massive library of professionally made video clips, which can be used for YouTube videos, for clients' work, commercial projects and so on. Let's see what they've got from Thailand. Well guys, this is it, I hope this video was helpful, check out the link in the video description as it will give you two free month of artists, two month of artists for free, yeah. Hit the like button, write a comment, write a question, I'll be glad to answer and I'll see you in the next video pretty soon. Yeah, I think pretty soon. Bye-bye.